Hello, today I have a different video for you and I'm wearing a Sweet Ninja Turtle shirt. Yeah, it's the best. So this video is a DIY. I will show you how to go from this to this. Yay! So if you don't know, these are called Z palettes. This is just the Sephora brand, so they've put their own logo. They've made it stripe like they're bags and stuff so it's really really cute and basically what it is is an empty palette that is magnetized so you can put whatever you want in it and you can customize it so I have two of them one I have made into my everyday like ooh, I, oh as I just put my finger in it don't do that so this I made into my everyday palette. Now I know this seems like a lot. I'm not saying I wear all this stuff every single day. It's just like I, these are the powders I can do a full face with and not have to worry and I kind of grab them every single day. I have a setting powder, a bronzer, three blushes, a highlighter, uh, this is for brows, this is a brow powder, and then like a bunch of eyeshadows. Um, I'm going to have a blog post about exactly what's in here in detail, so if you want to check that out, then click the description bar below and all the information will be there. But I'm going to show you how to take a blush, or eyeshadow, depends, take it from here and be able to put it into there. Disclaimer. <laughs> what I'm about to do may be a fire hazard. It may be really dangerous. You may hurt yourself. I've already hurt myself. So let's just be smart people and don't take my word for something. And if you think you're going to burn the house down, just trust that instinct because I don't know. This is makeshift DIY, let's say. So also, if you have MAC products that you want to depot, that's how we call them, so take the products out of it. Um, if you have six of these containers, they have a program called Back to MAC, and you can actually take six empty containers and get a free lipstick or lip gloss or single eyeshadow. So let's just begin. So you can order the Z palette from the Z palette website, or this is a Sephora one. It comes like this empty like I said they have all different sizes I have a small little one too um, and then it comes with magnets and it comes with a little stick for prying things out so if you break your eyeshadows if you break your blushes I'm so sorry it's happened to me I broke my favorite MAC blush called Melba and I tried to salvage it but it was so messy that I bought the bullet and got a new one. So this is a MAC blush called Stay Pretty. What do you think about this lipstick? Hate it? Love it? Thumbs up? Thumbs down? I kind of like it. Matches my shirt kind of. This would match. It's a bright pink. Um, it makes you look amazing, um, but in with the different lips. So it's called Stay Pretty. It's a pro long wear blush. Let's begin. Take a little stick. I used to use, before I got this, um, just a really thin knife. Again, be really careful. I'm gonna focus in here for a sec. Okay, I'm gonna be blurry. This is gonna be in focus. So there's this little ledge here, okay, before it clips in. You can see it right there. So what you wanna do is pry that up. So stick something in and kind of wedge it out. Okay, so I've just got that under there. See how it's sticking out? That's what you want, and then just gently pry. What did I tell you? Oh, thank God. It's not broken, but that just went flying across, and so, I'm not the handiest of people, whatever. <laughs> I can try to do arts and crafts. So that's what you want. Now you can use a straightener. I'll show you an option. I used to, oh, I used to do this. So you, this is not on. You take a straightener and you put this on top of it and you heat it up for a bit because what you want to do is melt the glue that the blush is sitting on. Da -da -da -da. This is just a brand new straightener. I don't want to get black gunk all over it. So I have another option. And this is the fire hazard. So taking a barbecue lighter, all you do 
Can you see that? Melt the bottom. People in the room are gonna be like, what's that? It smells like burning plastic. And it will. So just right in the center and just kind of turning it around, you just wanna kind of see it start to melt. See, you can kind of see that a bit. It does not take long at all. Go on phases, your fingers might get a little. Ah! So as you can see, there's this melted little hole in the middle. Oh yeah, that's a good shot, right there. So what we're gonna do is take our little pokey stick and just push through that. So I kind of push it through so that my hand can catch the blush when it pops out, like so. It's going to be hot. It's a metal pan. We're just gonna drop that, let it cool. So, now we're left with this. I'm so happy it didn't break when it flew across the thing. So, it comes with these. Make, they make it so easy. All you do, peel off the back, stick the magnet on the back, take your palette, That looks nice. You can just have one blush. If this is your favorite blush, just put it in this little pack. These are great because it folds over. You can just, whatever. So I am going to be creating a blush palette. Um, I have done it with my Benefit box blushes. You just break those boxes apart, heat it with a blow dryer, pry it out. Um, this is NARS Orgasm, same deal. I have done it with a bunch of my Milani baked blushes. Okay, so I have the finished product. It looks like this. It kind of looks like a science experiment. I don't know, planetarium, it looks crazy. But these are most of the blushes that I own. And there seems to be a pink <laughs> theme, although those two are peach and that one's darker, but I just know what works with my skin tone, I guess. So yeah, this is like an amazing way to organize your blushes instead of having all these containers stacked up on one another it's so easy to have all of them in here you can just mix blend get inspired what you want to wear of the day and then what i also like is in my everyday palette that has bronzer blush eyeshadow highlighters everything you need you can just say i don't want to take that blush on the trip with me i want this pink one and you have a whole new look. So they're perfect for travel, they're perfect for storage, and I'm not getting paid to say this, I just like them, and I wanted to show you how to do it. So yeah, I am loving this right now, and it's so simple to use. So if you like this video, if you didn't burn your house down, give this video a thumbs up, leave comments down below if you tried it, or you have any tips for me about what products should go in your Z palette, I would love to know more, and yeah, thanks for watching, bye!